my closet, you guys. And trust me, it does not look like this 100% of the time. It gets all messy and stuff when I'm rushing. Because, like, the clothes get all over the place. But that's why I decided to organize it the way I did. So, as you can tell, I only have shirts here and dresses and sweaters. I don't keep my jeans hanging because I feel like they're going to break this pole. And it happened before, so I don't want that to happen anymore. So that's why I keep them folded up there. So anyways, the way I organize my closet is by the size. And not the size of each of the clothes. Because I will probably take forever to organize. But I mean like the length of each sleeve. And like the style of each shirt and dress and sweater. And you know, all that stuff. So on the first part of my closet, I have all of my crop shirts. Which I don't have that much of them, but this is where I keep them. Oh, I think this one is really cute from Urban Outfitters. And I also really like this one and this one. So yeah, this is the first part is where all of my crop shirts are. So the second part is where I keep all of my shirts that don't have sleeves. So I have this one, this one folded because I can't hang it. So they have nothing to hang on. And this one also doesn't have sleeves. So I put all of these ones together. Oh my god, trying to smother. <laughs> so this is the third part. This is where, where I keep all of the shirts that are short sleeves. This is all of the ones I have. This is where I keep all the medium length ones. Which is this one, this one we see. And the thick this side is where I keep all of my shirts that are like not thick and you could see through. And as you could tell, I only have two of them. Now, opening the other side of my closet, which we come back from here, and I already show you all of that. So, right here is where I keep the long sleeves all the sweaters are, that are thick and so yeah that's that and right here I keep all of my shirts that are not thick and they are long sleeves so this is all I have from Hollister True Religion I don't know which this one is from this is from H&M Albert Crombie, Albert Crombie as you can tell there are all long sleeves I feel like I said that word way too many times so yeah this is that starting from this side this is all of the cardigans this one's a cardigan and then I have this one also from um what is it from forever 21 this one is from styles this one's from I don't know you then I have this. I also keep the vest together with the cardigans. So now here I have all of my dresses. This one is from Juicy. This from Forever 21. This one is also from Forever 21, which I love because it's so cute. This from Macy's from Marilyn Monroe collection, which I think is super cute. This one's from Forever 21 and it has like an opening in the back. And this one is also from the Mar Marilyn Monroe collection. So now to the sweaters and thick vest and all of that. So what I do with this is that when spring is coming up or when it starts when it just starts getting hotter outside, I put all of the thick sweaters. Like maybe not this one from Hollister. Because they're not that thick. I keep them in my closet. But the ones that are super thick. I put them in a bag. And in a safe spot in the garage. Just so they won't take out that much space from the closet. So this is all of the jackets and sweaters I have. They're mostly from H&M and Hollister. And this is from my school which I just graduated from. This says I love D.O. I love Desiree Oasis. And this is a leather jacket that I think I got from Target. And this vest that I got from South Pole. And this was a gift. 
Back here is where I keep all of my fancy looking dresses. This one is from Ross. It has really cute cutouts right here. I don't think you could really see it. Oh, well, there you go. It has really cute cutouts. It's long sleeve. It's long. Ah, I can't say that word. <laughs> and it has a turtleneck. And they're short. They're, none of them are long. And then right here, I have this really pretty dress that has like a little skirt in the middle and also short. So this is my dress that I wore for homecoming in 2010, my sophomore year, which I think is so pretty. I love the flower on it. I don't think you could really see it because it's really hard for me to get in here. And then right here I have my quinceanera dress. It's a short, poofy dress and I think it's really pretty. And then right here I have my prom dress, but not my prom. It was my boyfriend's prom dress. No, <laughs> my boyfriend's prom dress. <laughs> it was... The prom dress that I wear on my bookshelf. This is where I keep all of like my leggings, jeans, shorts, pants, and my PJs. So right here in this first part is where I keep all of my leggings. Which I think I have a lot, but I love them more than jeans. These are all my shorts. And I only have three jeans. And you might be wondering why. It's because... I love leggings, I don't really like jeans, they feel really uncomfortable and I prefer leggings so much because they're just comfortable and jeans are not that comfortable. But if I do like jeans and have a je some jeans and how they look, I'll buy them but I'll always prefer this one. My skater skirts and that's that. So right here is where I keep my pants slash sweats. Right here, this is my favorite part, like no lie, this is my favorite part because they're my pajamas, I love my PJs, I wear them literally 24-7, I don't know, like whoever doesn't like PJs are cray cray, and these ones are my footy pajamas which are so cute and I love wearing them, especially in the winter because they keep me really warm. So yeah, that is the top shelf, and let's move on with the shoes. So this is where I have all of my shoes which is right under my clothes and what I do here is like since it's still winter even though it's not cold anymore here in Vegas it's just a little bit it's getting a little bit hot now what I do is I put all of my boots and the shoes that I'm probably not gonna be wearing for summer or I'm just not gonna be wearing them a lot I will put them on these boxes since it's actually their original boxes I will be putting them back in here and taking out like my sandals and like all of those stuff that I'll probably that I will be wearing for summer and when the weather gets hot so that's what I do which really helps so I could know what shoes I have that's why I laid them out out what here I'm showing you is gonna be in this pink box and what I have in here is all of my spaghetti shirts which look like this the ones that don't have sleeves and my tank tops I have this one specially because I'm the person that would like to wear um like spaghetti shirts under clothes that you could see through so that's what I do I have four different colors down here but I mostly wear the black ones because I don't have that like colorful clothes and stuff so that's what I have in here I also have some workout clothes and on the side and a shirt just so I can like take it out when I need it just really fast so this is a really helpful because I would know where to go and get a tank top when I'm dressing like fast or if I'm in a rush and all of that so yeah that is that 